Forever Brandon TV is back. And guys, I'm back with Tree of Life. Life Jennings. Guys, Life Jennings is an amazing singer, songwriter. Okay, he is... I've, I love... He's been my fave ever since 2004. Life 268, 192, 192, whatever. I, that was his first album. You know, I've been liking him every, uh, every, every since up until... His 2010 album, his 2013 album, which was called Lucid, I have not had the chance to listen to. But guys, let's get into the life of Genesis. We got to get into my favorite. Talking about the S-E-X. S-E-X is my favorite. Busy, which is, uh, um, they are busy. Oh, my God. Busy is one of my favorites. Then you got, uh, Let's Stay Together. Uh, uh, must be nice, you know all of his classic cuts that I, I I've just known for a while. He he he's 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 was popular for a minute, you know. But then people stopped talking about him. And but Life Jennings is amazing. He's also a Gemini, and of course his uh his real name is Chester Jermaine Jennings, you know. But he goes by Life Jennings because you know he speaks a lot of knowledge in his songs. Guys, I I just I gotta get into Tree of Life because I'm gonna tell y'all the song that I'm feeling, which is my favorite one. It's called a Hashtag, and it's number three. It is just the shit. Okay, I can't stop listening to it. Is is it's just the beat is just cold. I just can't, I just, I just gotta play it non-stop. Oh, hell no. Oh, uh, 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 uh. Uh. Like, oh shit. Okay, that is just one of my favorites. That is number three. I, I, I'm i sorry, I skipped the first two. You got the first song, which is I Love You. He has a lot of nice ballad songs on this album. You know, it's bringing real R&B back. Uh, he's just an amazing artist. I love the um, the um, album cover, by the way. You know, it's just, it looks like it's a lot of hands. It looks like tree branches. I love it. It's amazing. And you got Life Jennings, The Tree of Life. Okay, this album is just, it kind of came out of nowhere because I didn't know he was coming out with it at least, at least up until two days ago. So the album came, the album dropped yesterday. Okay, so I didn't get a chance to do the review yesterday, so I just decided to take the direct approach and do it today. So, we are, we gonna get into this. You got I Love You, which is an amazing song. It kind of sounds like Teddy Pendergrass. Okay, it, something about this was just giving me Teddy. Uh, 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 uh turn off the lights. Uh, it, it, something about it was just old school, and y'all, I it, it's bringing real music back. I like it. Then you got number two. She don't want him, which is like one of those bedroom booms. I'm just telling you, you bring your little your your, your, your fly girl or your fly boy, or whoever. Over your, your crib and get and get jiggy wet it. Okay, I, I this is just one of them bedroom boom songs. I love it. Do you got no? I done went to hashtag already. Y'all know that's my favorite on that album. Then you got um, we're not the same featuring Algebra Blissett, who also I've known about for a while. This is just one of those. Songs talking about the different personalities and different people. I love it. Uh, 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 just amazing. Uh, Algebra Brissett is amazing. Shout out to the K2 spot for doing, uh, uh, I think, maybe like a review or two on Algebra Brissett. I have... I've heard a couple of her stuff. I didn't ever get a chance to hear all of her, but I work. I really need to because she she just has an amazing voice. Then you got talking about love future, my girl, the one and only Demetria McKinney. Let me tell y'all something. If y'all don't know who Demetria McKinney is, she is the one who played Janine. Uh, uh, she played on a series of Medea's uh, family reunion plays. Uh, just everything, y'all. She is just uh, amazing. Sorry about that. 
She's just an amazing singer, okay? You know, I, I don't know when she's going to have an album out, but then uh, um, she has a single out. I can't think of the name right now, but I love it. Shout out to the K2 Spot for doing the, the, the single review. Uh, I can't think of the name right now, but he know what the, he know what song I'm talking about. Uh, she sounds amazing. Okay, her voice is just amazing on this song. I got I got to get her hot props. It's just a beautiful ballad with a guitar. Amazing, nice, beautiful voice. Then we got right now. He's just talking about being with this girl, having her in his arms. He want to be her Batman. He uh, right now. Talking about he wants to be there right now. Okay, then you got number uh, number seven, Pretty Is. Don't even get me started. Of course, this song kind of reminds me of Mario a little bit. Mario, however the hell you say his name. It kind of gives me a little Mario. Okay. Uh, uh, I love it. I love it, by the way. Uh, amazing sound. Nice, fresh sound. You haven't heard a song like this in a while since maybe like the early 2000s. But Life Jennings has been amazing ever since he came out. So, then you got number eight, which is People. Just a song dedicated to the world, people around the world. It's like a, a gather, a come together type song. I'm definitely feeling it. You know, he has just a mixture. This is just an amazing album. I give it a fucking 10 out of 10. Life, life, life. It's been, it's been, a, it's been a long time coming. Yes. Then you got God. That's just a deep song talking about what if we were God, okay? It wouldn't be no confusion. You know, that is just an amazing song, you know, and he is definitely telling the truth. Definitely telling the truth. Then you had this little interlude called 25,000 Mornings, okay? It's deep because it got a little piano. It's amazing. Amazing, 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 amazing. You know, the, the the last four songs of this album are just very, very, very emotional. Uh, well, kind of emotional, but a little bit, I can say inspirational too. You know, I like songs as inspirational. So he has a mixture of love songs, bedroom boom, all in 11 tracks. So guys, this, I don't think he has a deluxe version yet or in plan, but it's an 11 track album. Then you got Always. It just sounds like an old school 60s kind of sounding song a little bit. Kind of bluesy a little bit. But he is just singing his entire face off on this song. Okay. These songs are just amazing. You guys got to check out this album. You got to buy it. You got to pre-order it. It's $9.99 on iTunes. You can buy it. Or, uh, buy more than one copy at Target or Best Buy or at your local store. Okay. Any way you can find it, just pick up more than one copy. Life Jenna fans only. This is Forever Burning TV. I'm going to send a link in the description. Do it.